<laughs> Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. The video you're about to see was my live reaction to the final Smash Bros. Ultimate DLC. So if you guys don't know that today was the premiere of the final DLC in the finale of the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate presentation by the one and only, the man, the legend, Mr. Sakurai himself. If you guys don't know, I did a live reaction. And while I was editing my live reaction, I accidentally and didn't notice that I deleted some footage of my reaction to this character's gameplay. <laughs> I was pretty mad. <laughs> I was pretty mad. Anyways, <laughs> but to the video you're about to see right now was my live reaction to the final DLC character. And, oh boy. I got emotional and I was freaking happy about this character. So I hope you guys enjoy this video because we are going to talk about this specific character to be exact. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I hope you enjoy my live reaction to this final, the finale, the final character of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Hope you enjoy. Here we go. Woo, woo, woo. Woo. <gasps> oh! 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 Just like the reveal trail. Oh! Oh, I love it. That's it? Huh? Wait, what? What happened? Wait, what? Are they... Oh no, they turned into the figures! Mario! Wait... One... One last spark? I'm shaking you guys. <laughs> I'm so nervous. Oh, 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 uh, wait, what? <gasps> oh, my god! Oh, no, oh my god, oh my god, no, get out of here. I'm Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the final DLC for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. It's so from Kingdom of Hearts. Kingdom of Hearts. Oh my goodness, yes. A million times, yes. If you guys don't know way that Soa was my most requested character to be in this game. If you guys don't know way, then Kingdom Hearts is easily one of my favorite franchises, easily one of my favorite games to play of all the time. And when I saw Soa and when I finished Kingdom Hearts, yes, I actually did finish Kingdom Hearts. Don't judge me. I was I fell in love with this game. I fell in love with Soa and me. And I was like, please, please put Sora in Smash Ultimate. I was super, 
super fade so it might be a me sword fight. I was like, please, no, please, no, please, no. Until when I saw the Mickey Mouse keychain, I lost my mind. I lost my mind. I thought it would never happen, but it did. We can stop this video already. We need to stop this video already. Hello, everyone. My name is one and only Ouija Reaction. And today, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to talk about the final DLC character for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. So from Kingdom Hearts. Yes. Oh my goodness, yes. If you guys saw my live reaction, I I was crying. I couldn't believe my eyes. I was like, when it brought Sora out of the keyhole, I was like, yes. Oh my gosh. Like, oh my goodness. I still can't believe it, man. I still can't believe it. When I saw that, that smash credit, Sora is finally here. I lost my mind. I was like, it's real. This is a dream. This is my dream, y'all. Oh my goodness. You guys don't know how much I want Sora to be in this game. You guys don't know how much I love Sora to death. Because I want Kingdom Hearts music in this game. And we finally did. Kingdom Hearts won music and some remixes. Yeah. Oh my gosh, yes. And when I saw the costumes from Kingdom Hearts 1, 2, and 3, and the black and white, I was like, this is real. This is real. I, I, I don't know what to say, man. So, let's talk about this DLC particularly. So, if you guys don't know that his gameplay looks exactly like the Kingdom Hearts game. His melee attack, his L attacks look exactly like the attacks, his L attacks in the Kingdom Hearts game. And his attacks is amazing. <laughs> and when I saw the magic spells, I was like, yes! I was like, I caught it! I caught it! Because if you guys don't know that when they reveal Hero, I was like, do you need to have so it might be next, but I would have to pull so in this game because he might be similar to Hero. And he is. He is. He has fire, lightning, and blizzard. Like, I, I can't talk right now. His attacks are so good. Even one specific special move. His, I think his upbe that you can use three times. It's broken. You can easily recover. Like for, for example, in that sh gameplay showcase, he always did he. he I can't even talk right now. I'm just so happy. When Sola tried to spike him over and over time, he uses a beat three times. Three times to get back on the stage. I was like, yep, so is my man. I don't care how hard he is. I don't care what people say about Sora. He is going to be my man. 100% he is going to be my main only. You hear me? Only. Anyways, <laughs> but yeah. Like, everything about Sora, it's just fantastic, man. Like, it's beautiful. The reveal trailer, the music, everything about it has to be easily one of my favorite reveal trailers besides Minecraft Steve and Banjo and Kazooie because the Banjo and Kazooie, that got me hype. And in tears. And Minecraft Steve, that got me hype again. And I was laughing. But this one, that, this got me hype? This got me emotional? This got me crying, man. Like, oh, like, yes, yes, man, yes, yes, yes. Oh, man, y'all, like, it was everything I wanted. He is beautiful. His reveal again, his design, his character design, everything about it, 
Even in the top picture, you see what they with so much shit tomorrow, and, and everyone is wearing the Smash Ball peels? I was like, yes, yes. Everything about it, man, just beautiful, man. Like this v <laughs> I can't talk. Like you guys don't know how much I love Sora. Like you guys don't know how much I want Sora to be in this game. And even me and my friend, you guys don't know me and my friend, Young Reactive Royal, he said that it is no chance that Sora is not being in the game. I was like, I, I don't care what anyone says, Sora is going to be in this game. I was what? I was what? And I told him, and when he saw the reveal trailer and his gameplay, he was like, wow, he looks like a good character and he's perfect in Smash. I was like, I know. Oh my goodness, man. Oh my goodness. I'm sorry, guys. Like, I'm trying not to cry and get emotional, but he was so good, man. He was so good. What else I can say about Sora? He looks beautiful. He looks amazing. His Keyblade. Everything about him, his final smash, his stage, even he has some classic Kingdom Hearts music. What else can I say? What a perfect way to end the DLC. And a matter of fact, let's rewatch the reveal trailer. Alrighty guys, are you ready to watch this reveal trailer again? <laughs> let's just get started, man. Everything about it is beautiful, man. Amazing and awesome. All the characters, everything, even reference to the first reveal trail. So good, man. And when I saw it, I was like, it's it's over. But when I tell saw the spark and this, I was like, what what's happening? So good, man. It's, it's, I can't even talk right now, man. I'm just so happy. Until when I saw the last spark of hope. The last spark. I was like, I don't know who can it be. Until my Yeah! <laughs> 
Oh, yes! I'm just so happy, man! Like, I never cry like this before. Like, <laughs> yes, man! Yes! Sorry, man. I'm sorry, like, like everything about it. <laughs> everything about it was. I'm just so happy, man. Like I never cried about a DLC before. I'm just so happy, man. So is my most requested character, and <laughs> my dream came true. I just can't believe it, man. I never cried like this before. Except for Axel's death and... And from the Sunset Paradise episode. And then the Spider-Man 2 reveal. <laughs> a lot of great things happened this year, man. But this is truly one of my favorite things that happened this year. Alongside Spider-Man 2. Just can't believe it's real, man. And before we end this video, I'll just say a few words. Thank you, Sakurai. And thank you, Reggie, for everything. If you guys are wondering, this is going to be Sakurai's last time he's going to present a DLC file and presenting any Super Smash Bros. related. It's kind of sad. But hey, that guy deserves a break, man. Like, he works hard. But hey, he deserves a break. Thank you, Sakurai, for everything you did. For bringing us laughter, joy, love, excitement, everything about it. And thank you so much for bringing new characters we did expect or we did not expect. And thank you for everything, Sakurai. And I hope you're going to do well because I know you're going to do well. Because we love you, Sakurai. As a Smash community, are we not even part of the Smash community? Are we just regular Nintendo Switch fans or Smash fans? Thank you, Sakurai, for everything you did. This was beautiful, man. Like, thank you, Sakurai. Thank you so much. <laughs> we love you, Sakurai. We love you. So, that is my <laughs> video of... My live reaction and my talk about Sola main Smash Ultimate. I'm so so happy, man. Like, like I'm so happy. Like I never cried about a DLC character before. This is this shot right here is going forever. I'm gonna forever treasure it. I'm gonna put a picture frame on it, hang it on my wall. Because this is beautiful. Thank you guys so much for watching my live reaction and my talk about Sola and Smash Ultimate. <laughs> so beautiful, man. The wish for the link of this review trail will be in the description below. That is it, ladies and gentlemen. The last DLC for Smash Bros. Ultimate. Thank you, Sakurai, for everything you did. For me, it's laughter, joy, your presentation, everything about it. So good, man. Thank you, Sakurai, for everything you did. We love you, Sakurai. Hey, hey, you deserve a break. Thank you, Sakurai. Just once again, thank you. And that is it, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, the final DLC was my dreams. Was my true dream. And that, ladies and gentlemen, Soa from Kingdom Hearts is the last DLC character. Thank you, Sakurai. Thank you for everything. And we love you. Peace out, everybody.